Aaron Burns out with Salon TV. I'm here with Sake. What do you think of the London Convention this year? Yeah, it's the I think my fourth time I'm here, and every time is bigger and with the greatest artists every year. To me, you have a unique style of tattooing. Do you think that it's unique, your style? Uh, I think it's something different. Yeah. I hope it's something different, yeah. something between the. Uh, Realistic and with graphic designs because I'm a graffiti artist and now I'm putting some more uh, old school things inside, you know, to see what's gonna happen. Do you think other people are gonna start copying your style? Yeah, I don't know, but it's not bad. This because it be an honor. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. it's cool and uh, after some years we can see some of these guys that they are copying some that we can learn of them. You know, if they are new artists. They have different mind, we can see more new things. Yeah. Well, I'll let you get back to the slug tattoo. It looks amazing. You're a really good artist. Thank All you. around, you're really good. Thank you Thank so you much. Thank you so much. <laughs> know the truth when you hear this song. I'll leave it here, but you'll feel it when you're alone. Gonzalez, explain to me what you're doing right now. Um, we're working on a, a freehand biomechanical uh, bodysuit, I guess. Um, I met him here last year at the London Convention, and uh, I did one piece on his forearm, and then since then, yeah, since then uh, we've done all of this. I fly constantly throughout the year to tattoo them exclusively. And uh, he pretty much gives me creative freedom to do whatever I want. We just decided on a style, yeah. which is pretty much based on biomechanical and H.R. Geiger. I love him. Yeah, and um, he lets me just freehand on him. We sit down, we have a few drinks and other things, and uh, I draw on him, and he never questions anything that I do. Say your last name wrong. Uh, Lexi Vitali. Vatate. Vatateti. Vatate. Vatateti. Oh, I can't say that. Anyways, so what are you working on? Uh, I'm working beautiful. on a Buddha head influenced piece, uh, throwing my own twist on it. So tell me what's your uh, least favorite style of tattooing and what? I'd have to say my least favorite is just doing anything that I'm really not interested so... in. So. I have to work hard to make myself focus on, but that's part of the job. Something like if I wanted you to tattoo a chair on me and you're just not into chairs. I like chairs, actually. Oh, shit. <laughs> vinyl? Is it vinyl? Vinyl chair. <laughs> yeah, I do a vinyl chair for you. That sounds very interesting. I'm sure it would be amazing. Well, what do you think of London? I like it a lot. It's a really it's good like convention. I'm here. It's an awesome convention. Well, awesome, you, awesome. I'll let you get back to this piece. It's really nice. Thank you. Tisha Wood, how are you? I'm doing great, how are you, Bernard? I'm great. <laughs> it's a beautiful Sunday. Tell me what you're working on. This fine young gentleman, he is in the Navy, German Navy actually, came out today for his first tattoo, doing a ship, really awesome ship. What's your favorite style of tattooing and why? Um, you know, I guess uh, as far as my favorite to do, uh, I really love doing pinup art. I, I, I've got a knack for it, and I think the, over this past weekend, I really, I'm like, yeah, I, I think I could do a lot more of this. So yeah, pin, pin ups are my flavor, and uh, I love black and gray, of course. Totally want to do more color, but um, you know, so whatever I can do. Toya, how are you? Good, how are you doing? I'm yeah. good. I have some serious questions for you that I don't know. Are, are you ready for seriousness? Yeah. Put your game face on. Let me see your... <laughs> 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 
Let me ask you this. What is the importance of a thick, dark line to your tattoos? Do you think it's important? Serious one for you. A thick, dark line? I think lines, are, I think outlines are very important. Um, I think everything, most of the things you tattoo need some type of outline. Maybe it's not like a thick outline. Maybe it's a, a light outline. But you need outlines in a tattoo. Over time, a lot of the tattoos with no outline end up looking like shit. Yeah, 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 Kurt. So you have like the hair do you go in and the Fonzie name. Is that why you're chewing a match? It's more like a like a greaser, like a rock. Greaser, that's yeah, yeah, yeah. I need a Google greaser. <laughs> no, that's the, another thing. I'm way off. <laughs> yeah. Uh, what are you working on right now? I'm doing a like a rose in the throat. It's kind of hard to do it because right, not yeah. too much space to, to, so to do it. What's your favorite style of tattooing and why? My style? Your favorite style? Yeah. Uh, I do a lot of portraits. Yeah, I like to do uh, roses too, but pretty much everything. What's it like working next to Jose Lopez? Oh, it's pretty, pretty dope. It's, just, <laughs> it's pretty awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind of, I'm kind of nervous, but uh, I'm trying doing my my best. Yeah, you're doing pretty good. Yeah, I mean, you're doing all right. All right, <laughs> I, I hope. <laughs> I'll let you get back to this before he gets all raw. Sorry. <laughs> Thank you. All right, bye. All right. How are you this weekend? I'm good, I'm good. You like London? I love it. I'm um, just here enjoying the show, having a good time with all the, the LA boys, man. All the gangsters? Nah. <laughs> nah. So, what kind of tattoos have you been doing this weekend? A lot of script? A lot of script, just names and all the basic stuff. If I asked you to tattoo a colorful piece on me, would you do it? Maybe not. You don't like color? Huh? I don't do color. Ever? Yeah, but very minimal, man. Yeah. So you're really good at what you do. Thank you. We love you. Thank you. I love you guys too, man. I'm here with some badass artists. I'll let you guys introduce yourselves because there's a bunch of you. A.B. Alvarez, B for Radius Tattoo. Weiner, Tattoo Empire. Edgar Aguirre, L.A. How do you guys like London? It's cool. I can't complain. I miss Cali. Cali's the best. But uh, it's all right. What side? That's right. <laughs> Have you guys seen the shows at the convention? Uh, the dancers? No, we haven't. You guys are missing out. And you, what's your favorite style of tattooing and what? Black and gray, lettering and all that. Do you learn a lot from sleeps? I barely met him. What's up? What's How's it going, man? Nice to meet you, man. Have you learned from sleeps? Yeah, quite a bit of things. We just have a real good time together and, you know, I mean, we just, it's like we're at our shop all the time. I love that. Well, thank you guys for talking to me. That you want to live. This is Tommy with Saw and TV. I'm here with a little woman that's in heat. <laughs> so how long you been in heat? Oh, my whole life. <laughs> Not like that. <laughs> <laughs> Not tough. What's your least favorite style to tattoo yourself? What do you mean? What do you prefer less? Like if people come to you, yeah, what's your least favorite style? Um, Don't say right. Riding? Riding? Then that's gonna come out like shit. <laughs> Riding on little blonde kids from oh. London. Oh, oh snap. I'm just kidding, Ron. He's so like he's a, I mean pink kids, because he's all pink now, man. Look at that. I'm just playing. I'm kidding, Ron. That's gonna come out no, I don't care. I'll, you pick it, I'll stick it. <laughs> 